Hello everyone, uh, my name's Mike. I uh, just started this new YouTube channel up, um, mainly just to um, do some vlogs um, with my family. I've got a bit of a, <laughs> a unique kind of family. Um, obviously I'm uh, from the UK um, and my wife is Polish. I've got two children together um, and we've recently just moved to Portsmouth, uh, which is where my job is. Um, as I'm in the Royal Navy, and um, we yeah we plan on doing some videos um, of the uh, sort of things we get up to as a family. So I thought first thing I'm going to get is um, a vlogging camera. So I did a bit of research um, on various options, and the one that I decided to buy in the end uh, was the Canon PowerShot G7X Mark II. Uh, it comes with a gorilla pod and a memory card, so I thought that's fantastic. Uh, and one of the videos I watched with a review of it, um, that gorilla pod was it's it, it uh, is absolutely fantastic. It was uh, you could literally wrap it around a tree, or you could attach it to almost anything, uh, which would be really good for some nice shots, um, aerial shots, I say. Um, so yeah. But anyway, let's get into the unboxing. So. Before I buy anything, I normally uh, watch an unboxing video of a product uh, just to see um, what I get in a box and um, the initial thoughts really of uh, when someone's opening it and see what, see what they're getting. So I thought I'd do one myself uh, as soon as, I've, uh, soon as I'm starting this new channel. So I thought, well, what better way to start than the actual camera that I'm going to be using for the channel anyway. So. Yeah, so obviously it comes in this box here. It's got uh, obviously some pictures on there. Uh, it's got uh, some of the statistics on the side uh, of what it's got in there. Um, what else we got here? It's got a contents list. Um, so we've got so obviously the cameras inside, uh, a Gorilla Pod, 32 gigabyte uh, SD card, a wrist strap, battery charger, uh, and a battery pack. Okay, so let's have a look at that then. I've literally just had this delivered. I just took the uh, wrapping off from uh, Curry's. That's where I bought it from in the UK. Um, so let's just get that open then. Okay. So then. So when we open the box then, what we've got first uh, is Canon's Guide to Vlogging. Um, and as I said, I've never... I'm not uh, an expert with cameras in, in any way whatsoever. I mean, I've never actually owned um, a real camera, to be honest with you. Um, I think the last camera I actually owned was a disposable one, one of those old disposable ones where you can take 20 odd photos, send it in to get it developed, and then you get your photos back and that's your camera done with. So uh, obviously, like most people, I've been using my phone uh, to take photographs and videos. Uh, but as soon as I'm doing a channel, I wanted something with a bit more quality. So yeah, so guide to vlogging, which could be useful for me because I haven't done any vlogging videos yet. Uh, so I'll definitely probably have a read of that. So yeah, it's got various bits, bits and pieces and top tips um, for vlogging. So should be good. Let's put that over there. Okay, next thing we've got. We have some, some wrapping paper. Let's take that off. Right, it's got that gorilla pod. Okay, so. Yeah, we've got the Gorilla Pod there with some rubbish. Let's get rid of that. Gorilla Pod 500. Never used one of these in my life. Uh, max weight 500 grams. Uh, obviously, I don't know what extra you'd be putting on top of the camera. Um, meh, possibly a microphone. I, but as I say, I'm new to this sort of thing, so I don't even know if you can actually attach a microphone to this product yet. But it's something I'll certainly be uh, looking into. So, yeah, I'll open that as well. Okay. Yeah, packaging's actually very sturdy, so obviously it's going to minimise damage on the way. Uh, yeah, so there's your Gorilla Pod, and you can literally bend it around anything, which is absolutely ideal. Um, probably just try and bend it around my wrist actually and see what happens. Yeah, so there we go, holds on my wrist. Shake it around, it's not coming off. So, fantastic bit of kit there to go with the camera. 
Hi everyone, sorry about that. I had a few issues with my actual camera phone there because um, I was recording it in 4K. Um, it cut off after the five minutes, so it's exactly five minute point, it just cuts off automatically. I'm assuming that's probably the same memory, so I had to restart that again. But yeah, so obviously where we were was wrapped around my arm, and uh, that was a gorilla pod then. So I'm just gonna uh, stick that down on the floor. Okay, next part then. So we've got the actual uh, camera box here. Um, I'm just gonna put this on the floor now because we don't need that. And the rest of the rubbish. Okay, so we've got the actual camera box. Um, it says on a, a color black. Uh, it didn't give me any options for a color, to be honest with you. I bought it, as I say, I bought it from Curry's in the UK. Uh, there was no option for a different color, so I'm assuming that's the only color you get it in. And uh, yeah, it's just got a few bits of bits of information on the back, uh, some statistics and things like that. Uh, go ahead and open it now. Okay, so when you open it up, uh, first thing you see is the 32 gigabyte uh, SD card. As I say, I'm new to vlogging, so I'm not 100% sure if that is gonna be uh, enough memory. If not, I'll upgrade it to a 64 gig. Um, but we'll soon see about that, uh, as I say, when I start making my videos, uh, we'll have a look if that's actually enough. should be though, uh, it's quite a lot of memory that, so should be fine. Uh, then we come to the uh, Getting Started pamphlet, uh, in obviously all different languages, but uh, yeah, so make sure you read that, uh, which I'll be doing on completion of this video, uh, to digest all the information of uh, how to use the camera uh, and get to the most out of it really because I, I find if you don't read the instructions uh, for things there's always a lot of functions functionality that you miss out on uh, and you end up just uh, getting into the routine of just sticking with the basic uh, options so if you read the instructions uh, you can get to grips fully with um, what's available uh, on the camera then yeah. okay next thing is the safety precautions booklet um, and we've got your your European warranty there. Okay, in the box. We'll put them over there. Okay, next thing, uh, some packaging. What we've got here is a charging cable. Obviously, I live in the United Kingdom, so we have uh, a three-pin plug, as you can see. Probably quite alien to some of the other European countries uh, who use two two pin or American is a bit different as well uh, but yeah so that's a cable for charging let's get rid of that packaging okay Down right there. a bit more packaging this I am assuming is the wrist strap and it is yeah so obviously yeah if you're out and about um, probably best to put your wrist strap on so you don't drop your camera. I mean, I've dropped many of things in my lifetime, Name, namely phones um, and crack the screens on them. So, I, I mean, with the price of this, I don't particularly want to be dropping it, um, and especially because I'm going to be using it quite a lot. Uh, so I probably will wear that wrist strap uh, every time I use it. Okay, what we've got here? Uh, we have the battery pack. Okay, so that's the battery pack for the camera. Um, I'll put that in shortly and um, we've got the uh, battery charger here so that's the battery charger okay let's start there I'll put that down right then. so here's the main product then so we've got the that's the end of uh, everything in the box there so I'll put that down on the floor so the actual camera then <clears throat> first thoughts um, it's it's fairly heavy. I mean, I, I'm not as I say, I'm, I'm not used to uh, using cameras like this, but it feels fairly heavy. Uh, it looks it looks really nice, um, and the this material on here feels lovely. It's like a, it feels almost like a rubber a rubber kind of material, but feels very good quality, um, and it feels quite robust as well. To be completely honest with you, um, which is nice to. All right, guys. So what I've done is, um, in the instructions or setting up guide, it does say that you're supposed to charge your battery straight away. 
Um, however, I, don't, I haven't done that just obviously for this video so we can quickly have a look, but it's like when you turn it on. Um, <laughs> okay, I'm going to be completely honest with you here. When I t first turned it on, I was having a right nightmare trying to um, set the date. So when, so when you turn it on initially, uh, I'll turn it on again, you're greeted with this screen then um, to set the date and time. And there's a bezel here uh, that you can turn uh, to, to change the numbers for the date, and, uh, etc. Um, and I could not for the life of me work out how to move to the next uh, to the next number or to the month uh, in the UK obviously in America I know it's a different way around um, yeah so I, I, I was having a nightmare so I had to revert, refer to the instructions and I, I actually only just realised that it's touch screen so um, that's, so I'm obviously showing my age now um, but yeah t I wasn't expecting it to be touch screen so yeah so it's quite easy Okay, I had a uh, um, camera issue there. The whole thing fell over, so uh, I'll have to start on one again. So yeah, you turn it on, and as I was saying, it's all touch screen, which is ideal. So today's the 4th, I'm just going to set this now. 4th of July 2021, and the time is... Uh, time is 14.27 so, or you can also change it on the bezel as well as I was saying 14.27 ok and we'll set that there um, time zone well I'm going to have to go with London so GMT and there we go, it's all set up ready to use now. Um, however, I haven't got my memory card in, so I guess I'm going to have to do that. But uh, where do we put that on then? There we go, put the card in here. Okay, which is next, it's adjacent to where the, uh, the battery is. So we'll just stick that in there now. Okay, that's the memory card in its housing now. Uh, it's actually showing me a low battery level, so I will have to charge this now. Uh, but on first thoughts, um, the camera uh, feels lovely. Um, I'm looking forward to using it. And uh, I will do a review on this um, in a few weeks once I've done a few videos on it. And uh, to be honest with you, if you come back in a few weeks, you'll be able to see the videos for yourself. All my content from now on that I'm going to start doing will be with this camera. So if you actually want to see the quality of it, uh, then do subscribe uh, and like my channel. And uh, subsequent videos will be using this camera. Uh, so you can have a good look at that. But uh, as I say, future content will be uh, revolving around vlogs of me and my family um, in and around the Portsmouth area. Uh, some potentially with my job in the Royal Navy and uh, various other bits and pieces. But thanks very much for watching. Please like and subscribe and uh, all the best. Thanks.